Yo guys, what is going on? It is your girl Randy Movie here and welcome back to another video. I'm doing a video, it is pretty late right now, it's nearly half past one in the morning. I'm doing a video right now because I just want to get one done out of the way so I can edit it tomorrow and not upload it. I've wanted to do this for a while, but before we go on to the video guys, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe button, turn on your notifications to get notified every time I upload a crazy video. I've been seeing these quite a while. On the TV, wait, the claim, disclaimer, and now I look a mess. I'm smothering with a cold right now. It's late, I'm ready for bed. I'm literally about to have a bath, I'm going to sleep because I'm so tired. But yeah, I've been seeing these on the TV for quite a while, guys, and I thought, you know, I'm sure I can come up with a good idea for that. So I was shopping yesterday for my for my niece for Christmas, and I came across this. That's right, guys. I came across wishy shit sand. And I thought, you know, this is pretty much the same as Connect Sand. It's gotta be. Um, you know, yeah. Don't make a mess, non-toxic. Pretty good, pretty good. And then I started reading the instructions, guys, on how to keep this thing safe. Where are we? No. Oh, always keep it there. Keep away from eyes, nose, and mouth. Do not place a mouth to swallow. If there are, never use a store in an area where products may be exposed to sparks or fire. And I was like, okay, that's a little bit crazy. Because, yeah, obviously, you know, don't store stuff where stuff can be, you know, caught fire because of you know safety has and stuff like plastic and stuff but do they generally mean the box or do they mean the sand i have opened this but even when you look on the sand it clearly says can we focus never use or store in an area where products may be exposed to spark flames or heat do not mix with any other type of brand of sand guys keep away from eyes and apparently it's non-older as well but damn this smells disgusting so Here's what we're going to do for today's video guys, we're going to take this bag of sand, we're going to play with it for about 2 minutes and then we're going to spread it out guys and do a few tests. Now the first test I'm going to do is put it in water and see what happens because it says do not mix with water so I'm going to do that and see what happens. Then what we're going to do guys, we are going to set this thing alight and see what happens. I doubt that anything's going to happen because sand, you know, come on, sand isn't toxic. You can light a fire on the sand, it puts it out more than anything. But it says don't mix with anything that's flammable or anything that can cause a fire. So I want to test this out and see how, you know, suitable this is for kids over the age of three. After reading that, I was like, nah, I'm not giving this to my niece because I was generally going to just buy it, play with it for about two seconds put it in the box and I give it to my niece for Christmas because she's only like two so she won't really understand I've opened it and played with it but after reading the box I was like nah, I'm not giving that to my like two year old niece no way so let's just get on with this guys the first start with guys we're gonna take this year oh guys here's what comes in the box then you are actually wanting to buy this okay here's the box okay here we go so here's the box guys squishy sand buy warm um blah 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 Here are the instruction things. As you can clearly see there, do not never you never use the store in an area where products may be exposed to flames, blah blah blah. Inside the actual box, guys, we get okay, we get this sand, this big massive bag of sand, and it is not too sure how heavy this is, but it's it's pretty heavy. Um we had instructions as well, but you know, keeps instructions. This rolling thing. A spade on this thing right here. So let's do this. Let's place this on here. Okay. Um, I don't understand the purpose of this, just to let you all know. I understand no purpose of this at all. Is it meant to be like It's nothing like Connect Sand. It's just like normal wet sand. Like generally, it does not come alive. It's not even squishy, like a little bit squishy, but not squishy, squishy. I've got a better idea, let's get a cup. Oh my God, this is gonna make a mess. See the things that they do not say when advertising this is the mess that these things make. They say, oh yeah, it's mess free, but is it hell? Is it hell mess free? But no, I swear to God, I'm not gonna be able to get it out of this cup. Oh, damn, we've done something, we've done something. It leaves a really oily residue on this hands as well. I can't get it out. Oh my God, this is not working. <laughs> I built a sand castle. Oh my God, it looks like one of them things. 
off. Hold on, let me just like the mouth in. Oh my god, I'm breaking it. Bubble gum. What's that thing called? That thing called um, Night in the Museum. <clears throat> and he's like, I want some gum gum. Dum bum wants some gum gum. Well, dum bum ain't getting no gum gum. Oh my god, I got it wet. Look what happens? It goes like a really different colour. Okay. One of the most satisfying videos. That wasn't very satisfying, actually. Okay, should we just get to the actual main bits now, guys? Get in some water. Apparently, you do not mix it with water. So let's just get a little bit of a close-up in there. Is it waterproof? I swear to God, that is waterproof. Guys, it's friggin' waterproof. Oh my God, it's going all hanging. Hold on. It's not connected, it's not like connecting anymore. Oh my god, this is disgusting. It's generally like waterproof. Ew, this is disgusting. It's just turned into wet sand. Okay, so that's what happens when you put water to it. And I can see why it tells you not to put it down into the sink now obviously once you put water to it the reaction that you're meant to be getting has just totally disappeared and you now no longer have a reaction to it okay toys number two my house is just full of toys Step two, we're gonna light it and see what happens and take you out the back for this one because yeah, it's a long and we could literally go in flames. So let's go. Oh my god, it is so dark out here. What the hell is that? I like that. I'm not going to put my hand towards it with the lighter. I'm gonna light a piece of paper. Nothing's happening. I was expecting more of a reaction than that. Maybe it's the actual, like, I don't understand. Maybe it's just, like, literally the... Okay. Maybe it's just the plastic bit that's, like... Oh my god, I can hear it going... I don't know, maybe it's just a plastic bit that they tell you to stay away from them. Okay, um... Maybe it generally... Oh, it's like going really hard. It's, just, it's like literally going like really hard, the top bits, but it was like the fire was. Does it still mold? And does it still come alive? It still molds. I don't think it ever come alive, so I don't think we can count that one. It wasn't as bad as when the water hit it, but jeez. It's gone like really hard. And the smell, I'm not too sure of the smell. Interruptions. I think the smell is mainly the paper, but it does smell quite bad. Really? Just trying to show off, really. Get it, get it, get it! that was close so yeah guys I hope you like let me know what you think about squishy sand personally it's a lot of bollocks and a waste of money it doesn't come alive it's not really squishy it's just like going to the beach and picking a load of sand up and bringing it home it doesn't do well with water at all stay away from water with it and also the fire just, just don't even go there so yeah, let me know what you think. I could possibly test the other do not do like suffocating myself and stuff like that, but then you won't be able to see this video, so what's the point? But yeah, I'm not putting it in my eyes or mouth. So I hope you like, let me know what you think. Any other videos that you would like me to do, let me know. And it's been Randy Nupu, and I'm out. Peace.